Hey everyone, welcome back to Digi Daily. Uh, quite a weird day yesterday, wasn't it? And the NBA is suspended, NCAA is not playing for anyone. They're playing at empty, uh, empty stadiums. Uh, bunch of bunch of crazy crap. Uh, public the public schools in my area have closed uh, today and tomorrow to sanitize the places. Um, however, my job didn't, so I just called out as a precaution because um, I ain't trying to get sick, you know. Uh, which is kind of incriminating myself, but at the same time, like, it doesn't matter. Who cares? Who's watching this? No one, no one who I work for watches this. Um, so it's no big deal. Um, I want to apologize for yesterday's episode. Uh, no one complained about it, but this chair is a little squeaky, and it was driving me insane when I was editing it. Um, the squeaking should be to a minimum. I have re... I've re-adjusted uh, the tripod to where it's not crashing into my, my seat. So we should be good. Uh, we'll hopefully be good. But if that becomes more and more of a problem, I'm going to have to just use the old chair. Uh, which sucks, but like, I, you know, I'd rather have that than uh, hear that squeaking every episode. I, if it drives me crazy... <sighs> Excuse me. If it drives me crazy, I'm pretty sure it'll drive you guys crazy, so I will, like I said, keep it to a minimum. Um, but let's hop right into it. We still have Ross and Mon. Don't really know what to do with them. I've already completed the... I've already completed the quest mode. I've already shown off his face and everything, so I'm probably just gonna let him die and call it a day. Let me see who's in storage real quick, because maybe I want to keep him. I don't really know. I don't have much of a... Nah, sorry. Ancient Sphinx, Ancient Sphinx Mon's cool. I'll just raise another Rosen Mon later down the road and, and get, like, the full line properly instead of, you know, having to readjust. Um, but let's talk about Scorpio Mon. Yeah, that's his name. How could I not even, like, think... I was gonna say Scorpion Mon, <laughs> but I was like, that's too stupid. Turns out, no. Uh, no, it's not. Uh, quite the opposite. Um, I checked a little guide because we're very close to... Um, I checked the guide because we're very close to like, you know, the mega uh, form and I wanted to see like what we'd possibly get and it looks like every form I've gotten so far is like the trash line. Um, it's pretty much like the line you get when you're just not doing really anything that really means anything, which is a little bit of a shame, but at the same time, you know, kind of on brand. So uh, let's see what it'll become. Um, let's go with, what can I get him? Bug? That's weird. Alright. Bird? No. Alright, let's get some more DNA little, little, little packets. More darkness. More holy. More of that. More dragon. More fish. I haven't used fish once. Uh, none of these Digimon needed it. Uh, and then darkness. Uh, so I guess I'll give him a dragon and a darkness and see where that takes us. Dragon. Too dark. There we go. Let's see what he becomes. I'm going to guess Serapimon. I checked and it might end up being Serapimon. Oh, it's Serapimon. Looks to me like Serapimon. His head looks a little weird. Um, yeah, that's Serapimon. Okay, I mean, that's kind of weird that Serapimon's the one they just give you if you don't have any... If you don't meet any expectations, it just gives you Serapimon. That's a kind of cool Digimon to just give away like that. Uh, I think he deserves better. I feel like Seraphimon would require better care, or, you know, the holy. Um, more holy. But, hey, whatever. Uh, let's see if we can get... So now what we've unlocked is we have the first gear, got the second gear, got the third gear, now we got the red gear. Okay, so 4,000. That's probably not going to do anything. Um, yeah. 
All right, so we gotta find two things. One, his Terra hit, and two, his burst. So I did find out that if you have no DP, you cannot burst evolve. So that's why towards the end there, when I was in the Coliseum, Scorpiomon was not going burst because we had run out. Oh, there we go, boom! Seraphimon burst mode, he's got like a giant like cannon it looks like? Or is that like a, a shield? Whoa! Whoa! Holy shit! That was awesome. That was awesome. Hold on, let's see how much, uh, how much DP I have after all that, yeah. We were at 200, now we're at 115. Doing a burst um, attack, uh, that cost you a lot. I think it cost you like 50 DP, something around there. Um, but I know the code for um, DP max, it is, uh, so when you're doing the plates, so if you if you were gonna do the DDP, which is the data plates, you need to have this middle one pushed in, and you want these four, like being touched, not these two, but these four, and just these four, and that middle one pushed in, and you can get uh, DP plus. Now, what I was using to push that in, let me find it. Where the hell is it? Hmm. I don't think it matters which one I use, but I was using a, a headphone wire to push in this middle piece, and I was using just my fingers to push the button um you gotta really push that in i'm probably not gonna be able to do it on camera just because it was a really awkward um i had a hole in a really awkward space okay well we got the thor's hammer um gotta make sure you're really pushing down hard if you're using your finger now there's a little um there is this thing you can print out I'll do it later, but that's how it works. I'm only showing you that it works. Um, there is something you can print out where it is, um, it's this like a, it's like a, a, a graph of each um, different plate that they released, um, which actually wasn't much. They didn't release many plates. You line this notch up with the paper with the number and that, that'll that give you the right, um, it'll give you the right item you're looking for. Um, you print them out, you cut the holes out, and you I guess you add something to, for this to depress, and, to depress this button, or depress this button, um, and then you add tin foil to the grayed out parts of the piece of paper, and then once you line it up, push it down, press the button, and it works just like if you had a real plate. Now, uh, something I did, I was trying, it wasn't working. Okay, this is a plate from the American, um, the American, uh, Digivice IC, and I, if I'm not mistaken, I guess not, because, like, I could have swore that this has the same amount of pins as the American one, but maybe it doesn't. It doesn't. I never noticed that. I thought it was the same, but it's actually not. If you look closely. Also, this thing's really yellow. Like, I... You know, it shouldn't be that yellow. I gotta take this thing apart, because I feel like... I don't know. I gotta take this thing apart so I can, like, retro-bright the sides here. They're both yellow now, and the top is getting yellow, too. I don't like that. Anyway, uh, I never noticed that. It, oh, sorry. It Actually, this is five, and this is six. So that's why this wasn't working, is because... Uh, one of them is not like the other. Um, I never noticed that. I always thought the... I know the Japanese one's different too has a different pattern altogether um but one thing i didn't i didn't know because i was like this 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 employs a lot of design choices and a lot of um mechanics that are used in the ic and i thought this release this was released at the same time as the ic but actually that's not the case this was actually released before and the ic or the D digimon the data link digivice is actually based off of this device uh, the xl heavily based off of it, which I think is super cool. Um, the whole DNA thing that was carried over into the IC, this thing was carried over into the IC, the three-prong connector was carried over into the IC, um, and the data plates, it's all carried over. And I think that's super cool. I just, I never noticed. It's just funny to me. Uh, this one, 
I believe has enough. This is actually, this came with a bootleg uh, Digivite IC I bought a while back. Um, I do not know if they're even available anymore, but we'll see if this uh, registers as anything uh, on this device. I doubt it's gonna work because there's nothing in the middle pushing it down, but hey, let's see. Yeah, there's nothing in the middle pushing it down, but I mean like I could like add something to push that little piece down and then we can see what it'll do. Yeah, I mean, let's just see if this is even registering as anything. Let's see. Oh yeah, some of them seems like it is. Ooh. So this thing isn't entirely useless. I can, uh, this, I think this is gonna give me one of every single, um, oh, not one. So I got my one, two of that. Who knows how many of that, because I'm maxed out. Okay, no, okay. All right, well, anyway, um, so this isn't completely useless. I can actually use this to, uh, to get some items and stuff. Well, not items, mostly just data. Um, but hey, that's good. It's real good. Okay, I'm back. Sorry about that. Here's a quick fun fact. Uh, when you're washing your hands, if you're getting tired of singing the happy birthday song, some other things that have 20 second long choruses are Staying Alive, Butterfly, the first opening of Digimon Adventure, and also uh, Jesse and James' entire spiel from Pokemon. So if you remember that, you can do that while you're washing your hands so you know that you are washing your hands for a full 20 seconds. See you about there, guys. Now let's just jump right in uh, to uh, the the quest mode. Finally, May I I feel like we're here with Serapimon. He's one of the sovereign, right? He's uh, a mega level Digimon. We got this, right? We got this. All right, we'll keep it low. The eight hundred probably not gonna be it. He's not gonna lose. I'm just trying to figure out what his you know what his Terra hit is. Um, although really we should be economic about Terra hits, so getting that is not the best idea. Because then we'll just completely run through our DP before we can even get to the first level. Isn't that crazy? Like, no one has said anything about, uh, getting through the first, or any of the stages being easy, uh, or me sucking, so I'm assuming that they're just hard, and that's just how they are. Um, I, I don't know. Yeah, we're just creaming them. Apparently this, uh, because this, this, uh, baby Digimon really confused me because I also thought it was Aegistramon. And someone mentioned in the comments that, um, it, it's most likely a modified sprite of Aegistramon, or Aegistramon. Um, and they just kind of made him a baby. You know, they just took that sprite, modified it, and then called it a day. Which makes sense, because he really does not look like a baby. Pretty, uh, pretty involved, uh... It's a pretty involved design for it to be just a baby two form. Oh, there we go. Oh, dang. Got he. But yeah, I find that so cool that this device invented Burst Evolution. That's so cool to me. Um, before that, Burst Evolution really wasn't a thing. At least I don't think so. Could be wrong, though. I don't think so. Let me know in the comments. Is this the first one? I, I want to say this is. I don't think there, there were any devices before this. Uh, devices that can do Burst Evolution are, I mean, technically the X3. Um, but it wasn't like this where like you change forms. It was like you, uh, you, like evolve, you have a quick evolution and then you go right back. It's kind of, it's more like, um, warp digivolving than burst evolution. Then there's this device, the, uh, digivice IC burst, of course. And then the D, or the Neo, sorry. I think that's it. But hey, I could be wrong. Dang. I mean, these are never the hard ones, though. The hard ones is when we start hitting that Mantis Digimon. That's where things start ramping up. Even though I'm 
pretty sure Seraphimon will wipe the floor with him. Let's just see. Let's do a full 4,000. So yeah, there's first gear, second gear, third gear, and then just red. <laughs> oh, that is his... Duh. Oh, no, okay. For a second, I thought that the full 4,000 was going to be his Terra. Good thing it's not. Right. Let's see if I can do it. No. No. Trying to get that Terra hit. Nah, actually, I'm trying to get burst. I want to see how that looks. Can a little. And the sound of this is just great. But then again, the, I, I I believe this is using the same speaker or same noise setup that the the D scanner had. The D scanner had a, a sound very similar to this, where it it sounds like you know, it's not like a bunch of ear shattering beeps. It is actually like noises, you know, like blasts and shoots and stuff like that. Um, which is great. Makes me wonder, like, do... I, I'm gonna assume maybe the, uh... The IC and the Burst have that, too. Those devices, like, I have the American ones. Uh, the American ones are okay. They're, they're not, like... They're not at all, like... Uh, they're not at all, like, the Japanese ones. They're kind of their own thing. Uh, if you like more of a Digivice experience, I... I guess the American ones would be the best bet. Um, the Japanese ones are more like V-Pets than actual Digivices. But, um, for a while, the Japanese ICs were pretty cheap, so I might as well hop on that before they get expensive again. Or maybe, if, maybe they're already expensive. Who knows? But I'd like to get an IC. I know the bursts, the Japanese bursts are expensive, and I don't think that's ever going to change. Um, but the Japanese ICs I used to see all the time, like, you know, like the red and black color, um, or just other weird colors that for some reason no one cares about. I guess only when, it, when everyone buys the Japanese IC, it seems like they only care about, like, the core colors uh, or the Kudamon's colors. So, like, you know, blue, orange, pink, um, Ravenmon's, and then that's kind of it. Uh, the red and black one never really sells very well. Actually, you know what? The Ravenmon one sometimes does not sell very well. Either. It's pretty cheap, too. It seems like I guess those are just not the the colors everyone goes for. But, I mean, I have both blue ones. So, I'm not too pressed about getting a color. Like, a wacky color. Dang it. Seven again. I think it's, like, eight last time we checked. I think it was, like, 2,800 was the... Or, 3,800 was that magic number that gave us that burst evolution. It is such a shame that they've just never made official artwork for any of these burst evolutions. Like, it's just weird to me. Um, like, uh, Slightmon burst, that's on the Neo, has no um, official artwork. Um, there's a couple other burst modes that just don't have official artwork, and it's just kind of weird to me. Like, they usually have official art for like every variation of Digimon um, and for some reason this uh, some of them just they didn't make them I guess the ones that weren't in the anime really um, kind of weird all right let's see if we can do it Is that supposed to be, like, M Mugendramon? Doesn't really look like him, but it's similar. Okay, here we go. Don't need that. Oh, It's 900, okay. 3,900. A little hard to get that rhythm. There is a rhythm to this, 
very similar to when you shook the pendulums. Uh, the pendulums had a rhythm to them. Um, more than just like the actual number, it was more like a rhythmic kind of motion you had to hit to get those terror hits. There were not, there weren't terror hits back in the day. They were giga hits. I think was the highest at the point. Um, so this seems like that. Where it's it's less of like oh tap 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 and like oh more of like a kind of a you gotta kind of rhythmically tap it. That makes any sense. It's hard to explain that. I just love doing this, if you haven't noticed. The button itself in there, too, is very, very clicky. I like it. It probably feels like it's a micro switch. Um, very good. I like it. I like this device a lot. Like I said a million times already, but I, I really do enjoy this device. It's pretty fun. All right. Let's try this out. Oh, shit. That's a problem. Mm. Oh, dodge that. Oh, thank God. Seraphimon is super cool. I don't think I've ever talked about Seraphimon before. Um, for the longest time, Patamon was my favorite Digimon. Um, he still is up there. He's still up there as one of my favorites. Um, it's like a mix between him and Terriermon. Like, as far as, like, Digimon, whose entire lines I really like. Uh, Patamon and, and Terriermon are, like, the top two. And... It's really cool to have him. I don't think I've ever raised Seraphimon on any other device. I tried desperately a lot of times to get him on the Pendulum 20th, and I just could not. I don't know what it was. I just kept messing up. To get him on the 20th was a little hard. Alright, that was cutting it real close, but that's because I was being an idiot. I like Strength Max. Alright, last one. Uh, and I, no one confirmed it, but I want to say that is, what is it, uh, 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 Aldermon? Uh, I can't remember his name. The fusion between Burning Greymon and Agunimon. I think that's him. Or maybe that's just Burning Greymon. I don't know. It, 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 he looks very scary. It doesn't look like... So I don't, I don't really know. And I didn't get the burst off. But it looks like we're going to beat him. Like, it, he's not even touching me. Big, beefy, holy boy. That's it. Oh, man. Are we going to, like, completely wipe him out? I don't think we've... Yeah, we're gonna straight up like kill him. Oh no, that's it. Nope, yeah, that's it. Goodbye. Okay. Yeah. You lose. You're a loser. Loser. What the hell was that? It was something burning. I don't know if that was a item or a weapon. Not DNA. Yep, it's a weapon. I don't know what that is, though. B something. I'm looking at it myself. I have no idea what that is. I'll look it up later. We're going to call that a day. So, we have Mega here. We have Super Mega here. That is a, uh, a run uh, done well. You know, that's a successful run. Another, another successful run to put in the books. Um, thank you guys so much for watching I am contemplating um what the next step is uh like I said I want to get darkness Bagramon on the x2 I want to keep running the Axel but I gotta check what the next hatch is let me check what the next hatch is right now um because I want to want to I want to really think of what the next plan is for for everything you know everything's you need to to think about the plans because like i said it, it's so hard for me now to run multiple devices it's not easy um because i am so busy and i, I hate when you know a bunch of people die oh uh, yeah next is the how to train your digimon hatch which is that's the 15th but i don't i don't know 
Um, and then the Mini and the Twin is April 1st, uh, which I don't have either of those, and I don't know if I'm going to be able to buy one in time. Um, I saw one, it was a Mini version 1 in box for like 60 which is like just, uh, it's, it's, it's ridiculous. I, it's, it's absolutely ridiculous for something to cost that much. For such a small device but they're hard to come by and it is in box at the very least like if i'm gonna pay that much for something i'd never pay that much for something loose unless it's super rare um if it's at least in box like i can kind of like i can at least you know um i i can justify it i guess um but how about you know um uh, i don't know I'll think about it because we're today is the twelfth, the fifteenth is the next hatch. It's a dragon hatch. I really like dragons. Um, I really like Cordramon. Um, so maybe that's what I'll do. I also, you know, people wanted me to raise Darkramon here, and I really do. Um, so maybe we'll just see how long it takes for this to die, and we'll try doing Darkramon on this device. And maybe we'll tab the X2 for now. The X2 might get tabbed. Uh, or unless there's a dragon on here, then I'll just start this during the hatch. Um, we'll figure it out. I'll figure it out. We'll play it by ear. We'll see what happens. But thank you again for watching. I really do appreciate it. I hope you guys have a good day. Stay safe out there. Wash your hands. Um, drink your water. And uh, don't be stupid. I'll see you all later. Peace. Woo!